Hello, so I wanted to walk through the basic functions for Project Starbeam. So once you get it and upload your code, you're gonna see a startup screen like such. So I'll restart it real quick. So you should see this logo come up and then the intro screen, and then it'll try and initialize the CC1101 radios if you have them connected. So there's quite a lot of different functions here. And I'm just gonna walk through what each one does. So first we have the Bluetooth jammer and this first uh, tries to initialize the radios. And then it will activate it. And then the same with drone jammer, Wi-Fi jammer and then CC11 jammer uses uh, the first uh, radios. So these are the CC1101 slots. And then we have uh, the scan and you could set the range for this. This is just picking up uh, random stuff. This isn't actually the real signals being picked up, um, but you could select the range in the code to, uh, where to scan and just double click to exit. And then next we'll have the NRF scan and you have to have an NRF 24 in there. And then you could just push the up or down to cycle through different channels. And then this tests for the NRF radios, see if they're connected. So CC1101 test, we'll check for um, if the CC1101s are connected and test S HSPI. Um, if you have radio four and five of the NRF connected, it will test to see if that is controlled. CC1 single just uses the left radio CC2 single just uses the right CC1101 radio. Record raw uh, records uh, car key fob signals. Play raw records or plays the signal that you just recorded. So that's what you do to replay on the CC1101 radios. Show raw shows the data in bits show buffer <clears throat> shows it in a different format and then this gets the RSSI of um, certain signals that you are uh, captured and this flushes the buffer of the data you had and then stop CC1101s just in case anything's running um, still you could just stop everything and then this resets the radios back to initial configuration. And then here you can program to set the different frequencies for the band on the CC1101. So you could quickly um, configure the frequency. So feel free to change those. And yeah, that's pretty much the functions for Starbeam. Let me know if you have any comments or questions.